Stanley Cup fever made it to our neck of the woods yesterday, even before the playoffs have begun. Terrace and Kitimat welcomed the visit, which was hosted by the Terrace Timberman and Kitimat 50-plus hockey teams. Joe Watson, a member of the Stanley Cup winning Philadelphia Flyers in 1974 and 1975, who was also from Smithers, was on hand to sign autographs and meet the fans. He says it's always a pleasure visiting communities. Go to show you the cup is, is, is magic and, and uh, it's renowned and it's just a magic thing. And this cup last week was in Barbados and Costa Rica. And then it went to L.A. on Friday. It was a bunch of movie stars in L.A. on Friday. And now we're up here in Terrace and Kitimat. So go to show you this thing travels the world. Not only could attendees meet a Stanley Cup winner and take pictures with the trophy, but hockey memorabilia was up for grabs with a silent auction and door prizes. Timberman Hockey Club president Mike Kerbrat said that this event has been in the works for several months and he and the other organizers are happy to provide this opportunity to the community. I got a phone call uh, about eight months ago from Joe Watson. He says, uh, Mike, how would you like to be involved in uh, bringing the Stanley Cup to Terrace? I said, sure, we'll get involved. We'll help you do that. Uh, and uh, it just kind of snowballed from there, and here we are. As keeper of the cup, Howie Barrow says he receives many questions about his role when presenting the trophy at numerous events such as this one. But the reaction to seeing the cup never changes. For those that don't have the opportunity maybe to get to Toronto to actually go to the Hockey Hall of Fame and see it, for them to see it up close, it's pretty cool and they have their own heroes or special teams that uh, they look for in the cup. And I, I don't think they realize uh, the intricate uh, engravings on it once they get up close and all of a sudden they see how many are on there and it's, it's pretty neat for them to witness, you know, 128 years worth of history on there. So uh, it's quite amazing actually for them at first sight. The Cup now returns home to be prepared for the next champions. For CFTK-TV News, I'm Hillary Johnson.